Nicole Scott from Mobile Geeks here, and here we have something that looks very familiar. Everyone's jumping on board the Google Glass Train or the head mounted display technology, and so is eTree. So, eTree is a research division of the Taiwanese government, and they are coming out with a micro LED chip. So, there it is. It's incredibly tiny, and what it does, it's, it's actually going to power uh, something like a head mounted display like Google Glass. So, what it actually is, is that tiny little processor or chip is going to go into glass and so they have this uh, camera here simulating the eye and then you can see that it's only in green for this moment but the micro LED chip is actually going to provide the light within the lens. So they're hoping that this might power the next Google Glass. Uh, currently we're seeing MOLED OLED technology but we're hoping that they might move on to MLED technology purely because of the huge power savings that are being offered right now. So this is only in green right now, but by the end of the year they should have it in full color. And right now we're doing one watt per 15 lumen and it should be moving up to uh, one watt to 30 lumen by the end of the year. And we're seeing a huge improvement in the brightness. So it's 150 nits for OLED technology and 1,500 for micro LED technology like we're seeing right here. So there's no, there's no word on what Google's going to be using in their next glass. Right now they're using MOLED technology from uh, Samsung, but uh, everything's up in the air for what could come next. Uh, eTree is very well known for pushing the processor technology because that's uh, what they do over here. They make things better, faster, and more efficient. That's one of the reasons why Taiwan is one of the homes for processors globally. So, this could be the next processor in your next Google Glass. Uh, I'm Nicole Scott from Mobile Geeks, just taking a look at what eTree is showing off here at Display Taiwan 2013.